Hello to all my YouTube maniacs, and we are in the, uh, well, we're heading very quickly now towards Halloween. We are, mm, I think it's the 26th today, is it? Today is the 26th. Anyone remember Kat? She's back. Um, and uh, today we're going to be reviewing something that I wanted to get a while ago, and they had released it in New York, and I guess it's actually available in bodegas in New York now, too. A bigger package for 99 cent. We're going to be reviewing uh, Arizona Fruit Snacks. And yes, I'm counting these as gummies since it's pretty much the same texture. And uh, when I bought these from Arizona themselves, I actually got it all shipped for free. And I got a bag of Arizona Cotton Candy Sour. So uh, that'll be interesting to review. And uh, if you've been watching my channel, you know that I've implemented a new rating system. Uh, and I've also added something extra today, literally extra. Uh, I rate on uh, packing and look of the package, um, smell, uh, taste and texture overall, and now we've got the extra category, so you can get a total of 25 points. Hang on. Um, I want to uh, use the scissors on this, because remember I'm keeping the packaging now. Oh, yeah. Um, yeah. So uh, I guess we're going to do the cotton candy first, since Kat was already uh, getting into that. Well, well, that's fine. We're doing them both together. And um, if you go to their website right now, you can actually order the gummies for a dollar. But the free shipping is not being offered anymore right now. Uh, so uh, let's talk about the look, though. The backside is adorable. Yes, the backside, I agree, it is very adorable the with the cactus. Tends to be adorable. Yeah. Um, oh, and mango. Yeah, I know. I'm not. I'm not excited about the mango, but we're not gonna let that color our review. I mean, if it actually is good and it says that it's sour, I'm not gonna discredit it. Um, so there's three different flavors for the sour, uh, for the uh, cotton candy. It's watermelon, mucho mango, and fruit punch. And uh, I like the way that this looks, so I'm gonna give it a uh, four for packaging. Should I just give it a four and a half? That's on you. Um, <laughs> uh, the four, since they're both being reviewed, we're just going to... Yeah, I mean, that looks cool, too. So, I mean, it, it looks just like their Arizona cans, the originals. So, I'm not going to complain about that. I can appreciate that it has the fruit on it. Yeah. Um, all right, I'm going to open this, and we're going to give it the old smell test. Sniffer real. Yeah. That's opened all the way. No, no it is not. No, so I have to give it more, even like more of a haircut. I gotta admit, the notch was pretty high Ooh. up on it. So whatever that was, it's that, uh, that like don't smell notch. good though. It's a combination. You know what of, that smells like? It smells like play doh. It doesn't smell like play doh to me. I get mango. I get a lot of mango. Mm, I don't know. That doesn't smell right to me at all. All right. Okay. I obviously want to stay away from the orange stuff. That's that's not for cats. Okay. So I'm gonna show you guys this real quick. <sighs> Grab the camera. Dun, dun, there we go. Dun, dun. Okay. Now that's the colors that are in here. Uh, I'm guessing the green is probably watermelon. I don't know. This is actually really tough to tell. But uh, the smell, that was... I'm going to give that a two since I didn't like that smell. What? Okay, don't... Yeah, please don't... Give that a two. Uh, it smells... Everything smells mango-y. Well, you haven't even tasted it. All right. I uh, guess we're doing green first. You can't base the rating on just one flavor, though. I don't know. Oh, how lovely. And by lovely, I mean terrible. Oh, wait. Oh, wait. Mm. Oh. I got a pretty big size, and it was, um, if you let it dissolve on your tongue. I did. That's sour watermelon. <laughs> I don't think it is, but all right. Um... I don't know, like, it's really confusing, these colors, because on the package, it's mango is like a yellow or an orange. Watermelon's pink, 
And, and Fruit Punch is purple. Uh, that's purple. Oh, I was looking at the... Yeah, you're looking at that, but that still doesn't match up to this. Why is one of these things green? I don't know. Okay, I'm going to try the pink one. That looks like friggin' insulation. <laughs> it does. Again, it smells like mango. That tastes almost like regular cotton candy. And I can taste the sour. Yeah, it's minutely sour. The green. That is definitely the mango. <coughs> That orange one. I think one. I'm probably going to avoid that. Even though that's the majority of the cotton candy. Okay. Uh, taste and texture. It doesn't taste any different than regular cotton candy, but it doesn't have a really strong taste either. I'm giving that a three. See, the watermelon, I didn't really taste the watermelon too much, but I definitely taste the sour the most with it. Can you do me a favor and go check on the dog? Mm -hmm. So she'll be right back, everybody. Um, now, she's eating the probably, now, as far as a general taste goes for all of this, I don't know. I am not, Maybe I am not pleased with this so far. Maybe a two or a three, Matt. I gave it a three. Um, uh, so... We're going to move on to the gummies. Mm. Now, overall, for... Now, this is just for the... Uh, see, I'm realizing there's a problem with the system because I should have, I guess, made up two different ones for this, but whatever. Overall, we're going to give that a three, and we're not messing with the extra category since that's just for bonus points. So, let's see. Four, six, nine... 12 from me. Mm, 4, 5, 7, 10? 12 out of 20 on the cotton candy. So that one, I'd stay away from that if you see it on the show. Yeah. Now we're going to do the gummies or the fruit snacks. Fruit snacks are a type of gummy, right? Yeah, that's they, what they I think. They the category. But this is not a fruit snack. Okay, so that was slightly disappointing. Hopefully, these are better. I like the classic uh, can size bag. Ow! Ooh! Ooh they smell promising. like the tea. That they do, and they do say original flavor. Uh, but there is mango in here. I'm going to assume that's the orange the, the one. dark orange ones, I'm going to assume that too. Well, this they is shaped have like a strawberry. Fruit punch, mucho mango, and watermelon, if you were curious. It also says that it has vitamin C. No preservatives, no artificial colors, no no artificial flavor. Which is really cool because that's the same way that they're... Uh, mm -hmm. That's the same way that they're... And the dog is trying to eat it. Tea is made. Okay, so I'm going to try the mango... Since I won't be touching that with a tennis ball. Yeah. Mm. Um, they're very small. I'm not even sure what that flavor is. And the taste and texture, it's run of the mill for a gummy. It's not like biting down into a certain type of gummy where it's like, where your teeth almost want to fuse together. This this really is more gummy than fruit snack, if you know what I mean. This one is shaped like an orange slime. I don't know. Yeah, the first one I picked up, I'm not sure. And the one in my mouth currently, it doesn't. I don't think it has a flavor at all. Well, okay. Uh, no. So packing look, I like the packing. So that got a four. Smell and taste. <laughs> Overall, the smell is pretty good when you have them the in the smell bag, is, but... Yeah, the smell is pretty strong. Um, I'm going to give that a three. The, uh... Mm. The flavor is not very strong. No, the flavor is not very strong. I mean, I'm not... This is not something... 
me personally, this is not something that I would reach for on the shelf because of the way that it tastes. Mm. Nope. Yeah. Taste and t I'm giving that a two. I mean, the texture's okay, but it's the taste that's killing it for me. Likewise. Overall, um, I'm gonna. I think I'm like at three. A I think I'm at a three for overall. What are you at? I didn't even count the overall. No. No. So you're giving it a zero? <laughs> All right. Well, like That's I said, fine. I I, I've eaten like three of them, Seven. different colors, and they're not. No. I'm not tasting a whole lot. I'm not. This tasting. scored slightly higher than the cotton candy. Like did. I'm about to eat a mango on and you know I don't even like mango. Like I said, this scored slightly higher than the cotton candy did. This. It's not terrible, but like I said, it's not something that I would reach for on the shelf, and I don't suggest you reach for it either. It's very plain. So, but I mean, I spent $1.49, I got it shipped to me for free. I'm not, I'm not digging it. So, I mean, even if you're an Arizona fan, I'd stay away from these. It's not good. It's just not good. Alright, uh, thank you guys for watching, and I hope to see you in the next video. I'll see you later.